ventured out for the first morning and it's, um, it's pretty hot. But um, this is a very interesting location because we're opposite the Royal Palace, which we're going to look at later. Well, I feel this is all the offers of rides, but you know, I think I'm breaking down and will probably be one, in one of those talk talks this afternoon. It's kind of hot, and um, but very interesting. Well, more later. I was going to have a half hour. Oh, is it? What's your name? Your name? My name Moni. Moni, there you go. Bye. This is Marta in Cambodia. After people started getting back into business in the last decade, everyone put a Buddha shrine in there to thank Buddha for fried green bananas. There's a lot of jelly on the left. Oh, yeah. Going by water. Yeah, this is Now to loosen the yeah, market again. I know, it's dangerous. Yeah. And now I'm The central market. Mm. No, it doesn't look like that now. I think she's... <laughs> she's gone from $45 down to 20 for the two, so I guess that's... <laughs> Having breakfast at Tomar. Um, they had breakfast at Charlie's Restaurant, which is just around the corner from where we live, and they've got Charlie Brown as their motif in the end. It looks like service departments up there that are... Well protected by all kinds of guards. <laughs> Either that or some mafia. Yeah. Cambodian mafia. Because there's dogs in there as well. Yeah. And they wouldn't have dogs in service at night, wouldn't they? No. So, okay. Here we are at the temple of Dal and which is very big. And this is a road that we have to negotiate around with on these two toots from the inner lane to this lane here and so far every driver we've had has never looked either direction they just go across all the lanes and as you can see there's no traffic lights and as you can see everybody just crosses in front of each other and they don't really look at each other this is the University of Cambodia I guess if you teach here that's where you hang your clothes or the students, depending on which side you are up. And somehow we got across this far. We got four more things across before we actually get to where we're going. Well, we've made it across 
two more roundabouts without getting run over. Um, even though it's one way, we think motor scooters going on both directions. Here's the offerings for the day. We're hoping that Narda doesn't take him, even though she is kind of a goddess. No, I'm not. She's the offering. No, we won't comment on that. This is probably what we'll be writing on to Sam Reap today. Express. We've seen a few people when we came in, they looked very displeased that we we're walking in here. I think it's because Narda's got bare shoulders or sandals or she's a female or a male or something. Or maybe that's the person that's actually buried in there. There's another, she's found the gate. Happiness.